show you how to power some small electronic devices with the help of a USB cable. So first of all you're gonna need a USB cable, some small electronic devices like a motor or a small bulb to power and uh, and an optional thing is to get some alligator clips. Here I have two alligator clips and uh, so first of all you're gonna take a USB cable and uh, I've taken this because it's not any more of a use to me so, and uh, it's from a s old mobile phone and the connector to and I have snapped off the connector which connected it to the mobile phone just keep this USB port intact right because it has to go to into the computer or the laptop to power your device so uh, when when you cut the USB, when you like strip the USB cable, you're gonna find some stuffing there, and uh, also a green, white, and black and red wire. So uh, you sh you should strip off the, cut off the green and the white wire, and just keep the black and the red wire intact because they transfer uh, power while the green and the white wire transfers data. So here I have and also cut off the plastic from the wires a bit because you uh, to expose the inside of the wires uh, which, uh, which which transfers electricity. So I have uh, connected some alligator clips to the wires and uh, now to now I'm just gonna put the uh, USB cable into the USB port on my laptop. So I yeah here th there is my USB port and uh, I am putting it in and uh, I am show you this this works so don't think it's fake or something like that and uh, there you can see it's the wire and uh, just it's gonna stangle and uh, now I'm gonna connect it to my motor which is right here this is my first pin connected and for the second pin as you can see it's working so I cannot connect it there we go I don't know if you can hear that but uh, it's working perfectly fine let me closer to the let me make it close a little bit closer to the microphone so you can hear the sound there you go and now I'm just gonna disconnect this here I have disconnected it and this this motor requires 9.5 volts of uh, power so uh, uh, we're gonna keep it aside and uh, I think that the USB cable is power intelligent because it connects to the computer and uh, it runs all my all my small electrical fun things like the motors and uh, here I have this motor this requires about uh, less power than the previous motor I showed and now I'm gonna connect this all this motor to the USB cable and this is a silent motor I took it off from a broken hard drive so it is working but uh, I don't know if you can hear it but if you can I have, I have like put it here like this so the rotating th stuff goes uh, to on the ground on the table so when I connect it when I make the connection the motor starts spinning around now I'm gonna test the bulb this bulb small bulb I have here this requires 5.5 volts of power electricity so uh, I might have to put the camera down here here I have the camera is down and uh, I'm gonna just there we go as you can see it's lighting up pretty decently and uh, that's why I think that the USB is power efficient or power as a power intelligent and so that was it guys that was how to uh, how to video and how to to power small electronic devices like some motors or some small fans which run on AAA, ba two AA batteries or AAA batteries and some